Hey, what's good everybody? My name is Jigs and today I'm going to be covering Pikachu's down throw, up air, thunder combo, which can kill at incredibly early percentages at the ledge. The first thing that I'm going to mention is that this combo only works when the opponent DI's in on both the down throw and the up air. Pikachu does have different up air combos that can potentially do a lot of percent if the opponent DI's out or doesn't DI. I might cover those combos in a different video as they can be complicated and platform dependent. The first thing to know about this combo is what the percentages are based on the character's weight. This combo will work on Pichu at around 55 and work on Bowser at around 100. Keep in mind that for all this testing, the CPUs are set to DI in and mash air dodge. First, you want to grab and down throw your opponent at the percentages I talked about before. Then, you want to buffer a full hop backwards and then immediately start holding in towards the opponent. This will put you in a position where you are moving towards the opponent while also coming in from behind. Next, you want to try to time an up air so the opponent is hit in the center of the up air's animation, so right in the middle. Keep holding forward, and once the opponent is directly above you, input a thunder. This should be a true combo if you time it correctly. You might get a hitbox on the upper that is more towards the front, which will place the opponent too far ahead of you to get a thunder. You want to try to hit with a hitbox closer to the center of the upper if this happens, but not too far back, otherwise the opponent will be sent behind you. A big part of this combo is closing the gap between you and the opponent, which requires a mix of getting the right momentum out of the full hop, getting the right hitbox, and delaying the thunder enough for you to be behind the opponent while also being fast enough to make sure they are unable to air dodge. One more important factor to this combo is reversing the thunder at the end to dictate where the opponent gets launched. For some insight, if the opponent is on the right of the huge shock hitbox, they will be sent to the right, and if they are on the left, they'll be sent to the left. To make the opponent be sent to the direction of the closest blast zone, we need to shift Pikachu closer to the center of the stage to get the correct direction. After you do all the correct inputs I mentioned before and properly hit the thunder, you want to B-reverse the thunder to send Pikachu in the opposite direction. This will make Pikachu hit the opponent with the area around his back, which will send the opponent towards the blast zone. You can kill opponents extremely early with this combo, and even if you aren't close enough to the ledge for it to kill, it still does around 40%. That's all I wanted to cover for today's video. Please leave video suggestions for the next video I should make in the comments. Bye everybody, and have a great rest of your day.